What is going on guys, it's Sook and I am back with another video on Super Duper Tech. And in this short video, I'll be showing you guys how you can upgrade your Apple TV fourth generation to the new tvOS 10 beta. Now the first step in installing tvOS 10 is of course to download the beta itself. And once you have got your copy of the beta downloaded, the next step is to plug in your Apple TV to both the power as well as plugging it in via the USB-C connection to your Mac. The next step is to go to the App Store and download an application called Apple Configurator 2. And once you have got this application installed, all you will have to do is open it up and it will recognize that you have plugged in your Apple TV. The next step is that you will have to double click on the image of the Apple TV. Once you have done so, go over to the left hand side, click on profiles and add your profile. If you are curious as to what a profile is, it's simply the file that you would have downloaded from Apple's developer website. And once you have added your tvOS 10 beta profile to your Apple TV, all you have to do is then quit out of Apple Configurator 2. And once that's done, you will have to disconnect it from your Mac. Now what I did, I did leave the power in and simply went over to my TV and connected it to the back of the Apple TV with the HDMI cable. Now if you do go over to the settings section on your Apple TV, go to general, then go to profiles and there you will have it, the TV OS 10 beta profile would have been added. The next step in updating your Apple TV to TV OS 10 is of course to go to system, then go to software update and there you will have it, you will have an update waiting for your TV OS 10. So guys, that is it for this video. I hope you did enjoy it. If you did enjoy it, then go ahead and smack that like button. If you are new around here, why not subscribe to be notified when I upload my next video. Click the video annotation or the card in the top right hand corner to go and check out my video where I received some iPhone 7 cases. If you have got any questions or queries, the best place to hit me up is over on Twitter. You can add me on Snapchat or Periscope for live behind the scenes updates. Thank you guys very much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Have a good one.